special first responders segment this week. It is a story about love and dedication, an unbreakable bond between a mother and her son. We spent some time with West Point police officer John Langford, who told me his mother inspired him to begin a career in law enforcement. They say a picture is worth a thousand words. When you look at this picture captured by the Daily Times leader in September 1999, it is one of love, honor, and duty between a mother and her son. You're looking at then police rookie John Langford and his mother, Werner, a veteran West Point police officer. The picture captures Werner debriefing her son, who is just getting started in what would become an incredible career of protecting and serving the community. You know, I grew up in it. I think my mother started law enforcement when I was like six or seven years old. So I grew up around it. And I got a taste for it and I liked it. 911, Bravo 1. Bravo 1, go ahead. So much so, Langford has been following in his mother's footsteps for 27 years. The lieutenant has seen a lot of changes over the years, including a shift in the public perception towards police. A lot of people think police officers aren't here to help them, that we just have to get them when it's not true. I'd rather help somebody than to get somebody. He says it takes a special person to become a police officer. Get in for the right reasons. Get in it for wanting to help people. Not just to have a uniform and a badge and a gun so you can uh, exert some type of authority. <laughs> just do it for the right reasons and have a good heart.